I'm here in the Dutch city of Maastricht, the TFAM, the European Fine Arts Fair. There are over 260 galleries from all over the world who brought a range of exquisite objects from jewellery to sculpture. But in particular, this is an art fair that over the last 25 years has established itself as the preeminent fair for old master paintings. I'm meeting Alex Bell, the joint head of Sotheby's International Old Master Paintings Department, to see how this year's TFAF is shaping up and to explore some of the highlights on display. So Alex, we've gone Venetian yeah. to start off with. Yeah, we have. Well, I, mean, I love Venetian painting. And this is a really beautiful example of Guardi's work. This is a, a rediscovery by the owner of this gallery, Charles Bennington. And in fact, Charles was telling me that when he cleaned the picture, he found there was a little added strip at the bottom with a false Canletto monogram. And the reason, I guess, that Canletto's name had been attached to it is that it is Guardi at his most Canletto-like. So Alex, we've shifted from yeah. 18th century yeah. Venice yeah, yeah. to 6th century BC Egypt. Exactly. Not my territory, but I can see it's well, exquisite. Well, you know what, it's not my territory either, but this is, for me, one of the most beautiful things I've ever seen at this fair. It is so rare to find an Egyptian antiquity on the market of this quality. And are we talking about, in this case, something that any major museum would, would wish to have? Any major museum would want to have a piece like this. The question is whether they could afford it. Okay, Alex, so this is, this yep. is your third pick. Yep. We're not looking at a specific picture we're looking, or object, we're looking yep. at the display. Yep. So we come to David Coutts' stand, and David is one of the best known and longest established old master dealers. But what I love is the way that he's embraced change. And David had a very successful Freeze Masters late last year, where he really mixed up the way that uh, old masters are displayed and use this idea of these sort of packing cases to present them in a much more novel and interesting way. I'm trying to work out what, where we are. From old master territory here now at TFAF, things, things have been learned and, and in a sense Absol they're moving towards the no, contemporary. No, absolutely. You know, in, in what you would think was a bastion of tradition, you are seeing real change here. And just wandering around the fair is a very different experience now than it would have been ten years ago. 